as this is a learning experience, I started off by using a scrap piece of metal and bending it so that I could try hardening it and see if it retains the shape. And as you can see, I had a hard time bending it, so it did get a bit stiffer. Thumbs up. Some coffee. Here I'm sketching out the shape for the bracelet. Using a can of the appropriate size to draw the curves. Then adding the lines for the slots that I'm going to cut out for the straps. And here's the real piece. Pretty rough. Using the sander to sand it to the line. Taking off the burr to make it less lethal. Feels quite nice actually. There it is. I'm sorry but there's a lot of video missing since my camera kept cutting off all the time. I try to use the Dremel tool to cut the slots, but it just took too much time, so I ended up using the angle grinder instead, and the result isn't that great. Some more sanding. Now it's time to harden the real one. Um, after I cut the slots, the bracelet got really soft at the uh, tiny bits of metal that still was left there. So I was really hoping that the hardening would uh, take care of that. The hardening really made a difference. It got pretty stiff at the slots and didn't really bend. I didn't apply that much force, but still it keeps its shape. Mixing some epoxy and applying it with a toothpick, just dabbing under each magnet. Scrap piece of cloth, and then I'm using this Velcro band with a adhesive back. I'm leaving a bit of paper at one end so that it slides a bit easier through the, uh, the slot in the bracelet. Just cutting it out. If only I could get the thread through the needle. Nope. Maybe after some coffee. Yeah, that's better. And attaching the first strap to the bracelet. Oh yeah, I'm cutting down the bar on the Velcro so that uh, when sewing on the opposing side it will be slim enough to go through the, the slot. And that's pretty much it. Please like and subscribe and I promise to make my videos better and with higher quality.
Thanks for watching.